Hey, it's AV. Day by day we are getting closer for upcoming Samsung's much-awaited foldables. And there is no stopping of the leaks and rumors about the Z Fold 3 and the specs that it will pack within itself. To remind you, Samsung is expected to hold a Galaxy Unpacked event in August 2021 to introduce the two most awaited foldable smartphones, the Galaxy Z Fold 3 and the Galaxy Z Flip 3. However, the new Z Fold 3 is expected to be stronger and more durable than before. And will also include several new features. Like S Pen support, to fill the emptiness of Galaxy Note this year. And is also expected to feature highly anticipated, under-panel camera, and in display fingerprint sensor. In order to assure more, a new patent by Samsung Electronics have been surfaced on courtesy of Let's Go Digital. Which was filed at the end of November 2020. Simply the patent mainly concerns the flexible screen that is located on the inside of the device, where Samsung wants to place multiple sensors under the display. It includes different types of sensors, such as a camera sensor, a fingerprint sensor, a receiver and a proximity sensor. Moreover, Samsung can also use different combinations by adding extra sensors such as an illuminance sensor or an iris sensor. But if you look at the patented image, the camera and related sensors are located in the top right corner, where the notch was placed on the first Galaxy Fold. And the in-display fingerprint sensor is of course placed further down as shown. However, the major reasons to embed all these sensors under the screen is to create a full-screen bezel-less experience without any notch or cutout. Since, the wide notch has often been criticized on the first Z Fold. But, with the Galaxy Z Fold 2, Samsung opted for a significantly more stylish solution by integrating a punch hole camera. And now for the Galaxy Z Fold 3, it is expected to be the very first foldable smartphone from Samsung, where the camera will be placed under the screen, which is claimed to be a 16 megapixel 1 micrometer image sensor made by Sony. However, the image quality is expected to be poor. Since the camera will be placed under the screen, which will not be as good as the cutout or punch hole. Although smartphone manufacturers have been working on an under-display camera for several years, it looks this technology is not a piece of cake to implement. However, technology like this have been already demonstrated by the ZTE Axon 20. Nevertheless, Samsung seems to be getting ready to release its first smartphone with an under-panel camera. Furthermore talking about the sensors, such as the underscreen fingerprint scanner. The fingerprint sensor of the Z Fold 2 was incorporated into the power button on the side of the device. But according to the patent image, the placement of the in-display fingerprint sensor for the Z Fold 3 is just off-center to avoid placing the sensor exactly on the fold line, which would complicate biometric authentication and architecture of the fold. With that being said, the new folding phones are expected to be officially introduced at the beginning of August. I can't wait how will this turns out. Are you excited for the upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 3? Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching till the end.